Stop worrying about running out of staples because this stapler requires no staples at all. You use it like a normal stapler and it works every time. It punches out a small hole in the papers and then tucks the punched out tabs together under the bottom sheet. This toothpaste dispenser and holder is the perfect product for your bathroom. Simply put your toothpaste inside of it, close the lid, and push the lever with your toothbrush to get the perfect amount of toothpaste. When you're done, put your toothbrush back into the holder to keep it dry and clean. This click and grow garden allows for you to grow fresh herbs and veggies indoors. The process is simple. All you have to do is buy your plants. We're planting arugula, peppers, and chives and place them into the included plant pods. Next, you'll want to cover your plants with the included plastic domes to mimic a greenhouse effect. Then put the plants back in and label them so you know which one is which. Lastly, you'll want to fill up your reservoir until the buoy hits the top of the surface, and then your herb garden is good to go. The best part about this indoor garden is that it comes with LED grow lights to ensure your plants thrive no matter the weather. Here are our plants after about two weeks. Stay tuned for part two. Our favorite Amazon finds, part 35. These prism glasses come in two different colors and are perfect for reading and watching TV. They reflect your view downwards 90 degrees so that when you're looking up, you're actually seeing straight ahead in front of you. Now you can fully lay down in a comfortable position. Our favorite Amazon finds, part 38. This Wallet Ninja is an 18-in-1 everyday multi-tool kit that fits inside your wallet. It's made of steel, so it's super sturdy, and it comes with all the tools you need from different size screwdrivers to a bottle opener. This one is perfect for right now. Our favorite Amazon finds, part 45. Did you know that your phone is 18 times dirtier than a public toilet? This phone soap is the only device that disinfects your entire phone. And while it's going, you can even charge your phone in the process. Just open up the phone soap and put your phone inside of it. It fits all phones on the market. Then close the device and plug in the power. And after 10 minutes, the blue light on the top will go off, noting that your phone is clean. This LED light bulb can plug into any lamp and is controlled with your phone. You can change the bulb to any color you want, turn up and down the brightness, switch to warmer or cooler tones, and turn the bulb off and on. Our favorite Amazon finds, part 49. This is the Mission Belt. It comes with no holes, so you can adjust the belt to your liking. It also comes with a quick release lever, so it's super easy to take on and off. Best of all, the buckles are completely removable, so you can cut the strap to a smaller size for a better fit and also swap out the buckle for a different design too. Our favorite Amazon finds, part 33. If your computer screen looks as dirty as mine right now, then you're gonna love this next product. This is an alcohol and ammonia-free screen cleaner. To use, spray the microfiber cloth that's included, wipe your screen, and then turn the cloth over to give your screen a polished look. Just look at how clean my screen is. And for a more convenient and easier way to clean, you should try out their screen wipes too. Our favorite Amazon finds, part 48. I always make such a mess when I get to the end of a peanut butter jar and it's stressful trying to get all the peanut butter out. This PB Jife is the perfect solution. It's super long, keeping your knuckles peanut butter free, and it has curves to properly clean the jar. It also makes spreading so easy and fun. These Ziploc popsicles will be your new favorite summer treat. Pour your favorite summer drink to the fill line in the Ziploc and close it off. Then place it in the freezer. Check back in in a few hours. Open up the Ziploc and you'll have a delicious popsicle to cool you down on a hot summer day. I'm obsessed with this frother. It makes me feel like a true barista, and it makes my matchas with the perfect froth every time. It also comes with this really cute stand that is perfect, so the frother doesn't touch the counter. 10 out of 10, would highly recommend. If you do your makeup in your car, you definitely need this. It's a vanity mirror that attaches to your sun visor. It's rechargeable so you don't need to keep it plugged in, and it's not too bulky for your sun visor. It was super easy to install with the straps. As you can see, it has two light settings and you can even turn them on at the same time. This is super perfect for last minute touch-ups. Amazon Car Resting your head on the edge of your bathtub. This bathtub pillow suctions onto the end of your tub and stays put even when water gets all over it. This is one of the best Amazon purchases I've made. 
Here are some of the best Amazon Prime stocking stuffer ideas. This lip care duo has an exfoliator on one side and a gloss on the other. I love to use it at night and it's under $10. This Tula Eye Balm is a fan favorite. I love to use it under my makeup and over and it brightens and deep puffs my under eyes. For around $6, you can get eight of these no bend hair clips. They're great for holding your hair back when you're doing your makeup. This satin face mask is another great option. It has adjustable ear loops, disposable filters, and it's so much better for your skin. This silicone mat would be the perfect gift for anyone who uses hot tools. It comes in several colors and would be great to travel with because it rolls up really snug. All of these stocking stuffers and more are linked in my bio. This over-the-door jewelry organizer from Amazon has ample space to store and organize your earrings, bracelets, and necklaces. It hangs over the door for an easy installation, and it also comes with this removable tray for extra storage, and you also have the flexibility to place it wherever you'd like. Creating a little teacher gift with things I found on Amazon. This year, I wanted to give my daughter's teachers a little mini spa day at home. So I started with a super soft silk pillowcase. This one comes in a pack of two. I then added in these amazingly soft, adorable headbands to hold their hair back while they're doing a face mask or their makeup. To finish it off, I added in these single-use face masks. This one comes in a pack of three and is super cute. I put all three together in little coordinating sets and added a handwritten note for the perfect teacher gift. If you're looking to do the same, I linked all of these things in my bio. If you don't like the hassle of using a huge strainer, then this clip-on strainer is for you. Attach the strainer to the side of any pot and strain with ease. It also fits on pots of all different sizes. And the best part of all, it's small, so it doesn't take up a lot of space. This dessert decorator is a lifesaver. It comes with five different tips that you can easily screw on and off. Simply add the frosting, screw on the top, and easily press down. The decorator is built with an awesome grip and scrapes the frosting on the side of the tube, leaving no mess behind actually are kind of big on me so what i do is i use these button pins that i got from amazon and you just pin it where you want it and then you button your pants so then it fits me tighter i found a 50 percent coupon for this for three bucks only drying them on these loose pants oops don't hurt yourself Yee! How did I not know about these before? I'll show you how to make the cutest crayon heart valentines for your kids' classmates. You're gonna need this silicone heart mold and some crayons. I went with red, pink, and white. Soak them in warm, soapy water, and after a few minutes, the paper will come right off. When peeling the paper, dry them off and separate them by color into Ziploc bags. Break your crayons into small pieces using a hammer or whatever else you can find. This was the most satisfying part. Use the little pieces to begin filling up your heart molds. Be sure to overfill your heart molds, that way as they melt, they'll fill up the little hearts. Place your mold onto a sheet pan and put them in the oven until they all melt. I put mine in for 5 minutes at 350 degrees. I used a toothpick to swirl the colors around, but I'm honestly not sure that this did anything at all. After about 30 minutes of hardening, I was able to pop them out of the mold and they are the cutest perfect heart crayon. This was a super fun and super easy project that your kids would probably love to help you out with. I ended up doing four crayons for each of my kids' classmates. I made these custom Valentine's Day cards to put in the cellophane bags with the crayons. I'm obsessed with how they came out. I linked all of my materials and a free download for that Valentine's Day card I made. Today I'm going to show you how to get the wax out of candles. Someone gave me this candle. I didn't love the smell, but I love the container and I wanted to use it in the house. So I boiled a pot of water. Once it was boiled, I turned it off and stuck my candle right down in the water. I waited for about 30 minutes and once you could tell that the outside of the candle has started to melt, you can take it out. Make sure you use an oven mitt and don't burn yourself. You should be able to just pour it right into a bowl and the majority of the wax will slide right out. To make sure that you got all of the wax out, pour the leftover of that hot water right into the candle container and let it sit for another 30 minutes. A buildup of wax will move to the top and start to harden. Once it does, you can pour it out, wash it with dish soap, and you're ready. It's so cute. I use them around my house. Here's an anthropology one that I have faux flowers in. This anthropology one I keep my scrunchies in. And of course, the one you saw with my makeup brushes. Like for more tips. Amazon home decor favorites. These modern black and white vases that come in a set of two. This bundle of dried rabbit tail flowers. I love wooden beads as home decor. And this set comes with four different designs for all around your home. And lastly is this gorgeous leopard print blanket. Link Amazon favorites, baby sleep edition. The first is our Dr. Tot. We love this marble cover and we use it every day and move it all around our house. We love this rechargeable portable sound machine with four different sounds and lots of volume levels. We have one for each of our kids. 
And the last is our Magic Sleep Suit. It works so well for transitioning out of the swaddle and they look so cute like a baby marshmallow. Always follow AAP guidelines for baby sleep. Product links are in my bio. Remember my stenciled front porch? You guys were going crazy in the comments about my door color. Some of you loved the pink and others of you thought I should change it. So I thought I would give you all what you wanted. So let's do it. I started with a light sand and then I gave the door a good wipe down. I removed the old hardware because I decided to replace it. Now for the new pink color. What could it be? What could it be? It's pink, but a different shade. So then I got started painting. After a couple coats of paint, it was time to replace the hardware. I found this gorgeous sleek black hardware on Amazon for 50 bucks. And I'm done, I'm obsessed. A lot of you guys recommended painting the trim around the door and so I did and I love it. The color is the perfect warm gingery pink and I think it looks great with everything else. I linked the hardware in my bio and I put the pink color in the comments. So what do you guys think? All decor must-haves part one these velvet leopard print pillows run about ten dollars a piece and are a great way to add warmth to your decor for fall buffalo plaid is another fall favorite and this comes in a pack of two for only ten dollars in lots of different colors i also love this cozy knit blanket for under twenty dollars these gold candlesticks come in a set of three for under twenty dollars these remote controlled led candles are also awesome and i love this dried rabbit tail for a little fall greenery this white berry wreath is probably my favorite fall buy it's under forty dollars and is the perfect fall touch for your front door all of these items are super affordable and i linked them in my bio or you can go to my amazon page under fall affordable amazon upgrades that i've made in my home recently this lantern style light fixture is around fifty dollars and made the biggest impact on my front porch Another front porch upgrade, this gorgeous sleek black hardware that's only $50. I love these gorgeous gold and acrylic knobs that I put on my daughter's dresser. They are so cute. And my builder grade cabinetry got a little bit of a makeover with this modern gold hardware. The link to shop all of these items is in my bio. In under 60 seconds, I'm going to show you how to make this floral basket arrangement for your front door. So far on my front porch makeover, I've stenciled my floor and painted my door. If you missed those videos, you can go back to my profile to watch. I knew next I needed to add some decor, so I hopped on Amazon and I bought this magazine basket and some floral stems and decided to make my own arrangement. I typically use the tape method when I'm doing arrangements, but I knew tape wouldn't hold outside, so I used some yarn to create a grid. I actually used a bobby pin to thread the yarn through the basket. Then I took all of the plastic that the florals were shipped in and added to the bottom of the basket for filler. I started with some greenery and then I added some accents to fill it up. Some berries, a little pompous grass because you know trends, and just a touch of peachy pink to match my front door. I'm obsessed with how it came out and the grid made all of the difference in how full it was. I got my husband to help me decide exactly where it should go and then I used a pretty black command hook on my door to match my hardware and I'm obsessed y'all. It's so good. It's just a little bit different from a normal wreath and I love that I can change it out with every season. I linked all of the things I used to make this in my bio. So comment and tell me what I should add to my front porch next. I got three new pairs of boots, but I only want to keep one. Help me decide which ones to keep for winter. The neutral color of these is so good. I love the chunky heel and the little bit of snakeskin detail is perfect. These were so comfortable the moment that I put them on. The fur lining definitely helps. The black pair is super versatile and I love the little bit of sweater detailing. All of these boots are under $40 and linked in my bio. Comment which ones were your favorite. I was so tired of having to crawl all the way under my Christmas tree to turn it on and off, not to mention all of the loose cords. And I was super jealous of all those people with the fancy Christmas trees with the foot pedals that turn the lights on and off. So I grabbed this one on Amazon that I think will do the trick. It was super easy to install and it works exactly like I wanted it to. I was able to hide all of my other cords and just show this little button that turns the tree on with a simple click. If you're in the market for something like this, don't worry, I linked it in my bio. Amazon baby gifts that are super aesthetically pleasing. The first is this silicone stacking circle. The material makes it perfect for little babies, especially those who are teething. And the soft muted colors make it so cute. And next are these plastic stacking cups. Both of my kids loved playing with stacking towers and the color of this one is so beautiful. A great toy for on the go and in the bathtub. Both of these goodies are under $15 and I linked them in my bio. Random things from Amazon that you probably need. This timer cube has really come in handy lately. Just space the time that you want up and it'll start counting down. This thing was designed to get Lynn out of clothes, but I really loved the way it got the dog hair out of my carpet. 
Super affordable and a must-have for any dog owner. This black marble cheese board is one of my favorite Amazon home purchases ever. It's beautiful, fantastic quality, and super duper affordable. And this miracle, magical cleaner is everyone's favorite. It has 20,000 positive five-star reviews, and it got old stains out of my furniture, my kids' clothes, and my rugs. All of these awesome items are linked in my bio. Seven of my favorite Amazon fashion finds in under 30 seconds. This one shoulder crop top is such a great basic. It comes in a ton of colors and you can wear it on either shoulder. I also love this ribbed high neck crop top so much that I have it in black and in white. I love to wear it with basics like denim and flowy skirts like this one. This skirt is so cute. It's a midi length and it comes in a ton of different colors and patterns. This is my favorite athletic crop top. It comes in a ton of colors and the v-neck is so flattering. I also adore these running shorts. One of my most worn purchases has been this lightweight jacket. It's so cute and comfortable. Add some sunnies because I'm not a regular mom. I'm a cool mom. Everything is linked in my bio. Amazon cleaning product you absolutely need. I bought this after I saw that it had 20,000 five-star reviews on Amazon. It immediately removed a two-year-old stain in my carpet, so I wanted to try it on some other stuff. It's safe for fabric, and I've had a really hard time getting these leftover food stains out of my son's clothes. Sprayed on the Folex, gave it a rub, and after the wash, they were gone. I am so amazed that I had to try it on something else. I've been hiding the stain on this chair under a blanket for years. I sprayed it down and rubbed it with a microfiber cloth, and I can't even believe it, guys. This stain is gone. Carpet, upholstery, clothing, it's safe for all of them, and I linked it in my bio. Amazon One Piece try-on on a size 6 body. There's a reason why this is one of the highest rated suits on Amazon. It's so flattering and it comes in a ton of colors. I love the mesh detailing on this suit. The fit and coverage was great, but I think it was made for someone a little bit taller. I'm only 5'2". This white was more of a monokini style and I'm absolutely in love with it. Really good coverage while giving you a bikini look. This highlighter yellow plunge was one of my favorites out of the bag, but the bra cups were up close to my neck, which means it was made for somebody taller. My favorite of the bunch has to be this brown belted suit. Cheeky and so cute. Everything is linked in my bio.